so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. And today, we're here at Yas Waterworld in Abu Dhabi in the United Arab Emirates. <laughs> yeah, this water park is amazing. There are water rides and big slides to go down. <laughs> but today, you and I have a special mission. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking for a pearl. <laughs> well, not just any pearl, a really, really big pearl. It's called the Mother Pearl. <laughs> hey, will you help me look for it? <laughs> awesome, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> no pearls here. <laughs> Hey, do you know what a pearl looks like? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like a really tiny ball. <laughs> and that reminds me, do you know the story of the lost pearl? <laughs> yeah, it's a really fun story. <laughs> yeah, it's about a village where people used to dive for pearls. Yeah, they would dive to the ocean and find pearls in little oysters. <laughs> yeah, they would find the pearls and one day they found a really big pearl. Yeah, the mother pearl. And it brought them lots of good luck. But one day, a really big storm came. Whoa! <laughs> and they lost the pearl. And we want to find it. <laughs> oh, hey, storm. That storm was so big. It was kind of like a tornado. <laughs> good thing they have a tornado right here. Let's go ride it. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. This place is so cool. <laughs> yeah, look. It's so rocky, and it looks like maybe there was a shipwreck here <laughs> with some treasure. <laughs> oh, and it looks like there's a water slide back there. Hey, I know. That water slide is called the Wama. Yeah, that's the Arabic word for tornado. Whoa! <laughs> hey, do you remember the story? Yeah, the story of the lost pearl. They lost the mother pearl because a big storm, a big tornado, blew it away. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe if we ride this ride, we can find the mother pearl. <laughs> okay, let's take a closer look. Check it out! This slide is huge! <laughs> oh, do you see? It's so big. <laughs> Ooh. Maybe if we ride this ride, the mother pearl will be down there. <laughs> Ooh. Do you notice? This slide is so colorful. <laughs> yeah. It's the colors blue and red. Woo! <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. I'm gonna go ride it. <laughs> Whoa! We made it to the top of the llama. I can't wait to ride. Oh! <laughs> Hello! Hi. I'm Blippi. What's your name? My name is Irina. Oh, it's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Do you think I could go on the ride? Yes. They oh. exactly need one person to ride. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's join them. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Closer look. Come on. <laughs> this place is awesome. Yeah, this tank of water is so big. There's all kinds of things in the water. Look. Hmm. Ooh, it looks like hmm, there's a bowl and <laughs> some really big bricks. <laughs> oh, look, there's coral. Ooh, <laughs> coral so beautiful. <laughs> hey, do you see that right there? Whoa, do you know what that is? That's an oyster. Yeah, an oyster is a sea creature. Whoa, and an oyster makes pearls. Beautiful pearls, yeah. Sometimes a little thing that bothers an oyster like sand gets in its mouth. Hmm. <laughs> but after a long time, the oyster turns that little piece of sand or whatever it is <laughs> into a beautiful pearl. <laughs> Oh, hey, you know what? 
I bet this is where people die from pearls. Oh, die for oysters. <laughs> yeah, you find the oysters with the pearls inside. Whoa! Hello! <laughs> oh, look, it's a person. <laughs> Whoa, and look, he's diving. Yeah. Oh, I think he wants me to come with him. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> oh, hi. hi. I'm Flippy. What's your name? My name's Silas. Oh, it's nice to meet you. And are you the diving instructor? Yes, please. <laughs> please diving. Where are you going to be diving? Find oysters. Oysters? <laughs> yeah. Oh, is it okay if I come in the pool? Yes, please. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, check it out. It's a mask. Yes. Oh. So you have to check it, put your, put it on, then check. <laughs> yeah. We want to put on the mask first before we start diving. Mm. Yep. Here we go. <laughs> uh. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> they don't fit over my glasses. I think so. You need to take off your glasses. <laughs> yeah. You gotta take those off first. Whoa! <laughs> Look. All right. Now oh. check it. Just put your head in water and check. Oh, it's safe for you. Okay, yeah, we don't want to get any water in our mask. So, here we go. <laughs> yeah, the oh. water getting inside. Yeah. All right, so now, before you dive in, you need to equalize. Oh. So you need to pop your ears to be more safe. Did you hear that? Yeah, it's called equalizing your ears. <laughs> when you dive in the water, if it's really deep, it feels kind of uncomfortable on your ears, so, Pop your ears. <laughs> you can pop your ears out, yeah. Ah, feels nice and relaxing. <laughs> All right, are you ready? I think I'm ready. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> Time to dive for some oysters. Yes, are you ready to dive for the oysters? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Ooh, let's see how many we can find. All right. Here we go. <laughs> let's go. live. Ooh. Do you remember the story of the lost pearl? <laughs> yeah, there was a big tornado. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, and then they lost the mother pearl. You know what happened next? Yeah, bandits came and took the mother pearl. <laughs> that was not very nice. <laughs> hey, do you know what a bandit is? Yeah, a bandit is someone who takes things that don't belong to them. Whoa. And look, Whoa, there's a bandit! Whoa! Whoa! Run! Ah! Woo! Keep your eyes open. You need to find the mother pearl. Hmm. Oh, hello! <laughs> hi! It's Donna! Oh, hi, Donna! I'm Blippi! <laughs> oh, do you remember the story of the lost pearl? Yeah! The pearl was lost because of a tornado. It was taken by bandits. 
but it was found. Yeah, found by Donna. <laughs> Thanks, Donna. Well, we've also been looking for the mother pearl today. You think you can help us find it? Oh, <gasps> you can? <laughs> Great. Well, do you know where it is? Oh, you do? Where is it? Oh, whoa, check it out. It's up there. It's been here this whole time. <laughs> oh, well, thank you for helping us find it, Donna. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, that was amazing. I had so much fun today at Yas Waterworld in Abu Dhabi. Yeah, we did some pretty cool things. We rode the tornado. We met a bandit. We went diving for pearls and... Donna helped us find the mother pearl. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? <laughs> okay, here we go. B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -I, Philippi. Good job. <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs> so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Philippi. It's me, Blippi. Oh, and look at where I'm at. Yeah, today I'm at Moxie in Santa Barbara, California. And this place is so much fun. It has a lot of cool science things in there. Yeah, today you and I will learn a lot about some colors. Ooh, blue and orange and other great colors too. And other fun things we can see with our eyes. Whoa, like light. <laughs> cool. This is going to be so much fun. Let's go. This is the innovation workshop. Innovation means when you take something old and you make it new or you make it way better. This is gonna be so much fun. I wonder what we're gonna make. Let's go. <laughs> oh, hey, Hi. who are you? My name's Kevin. Oh, nice to meet you. Welcome to the innovation workshop. Great, thanks for having me. I'm Blippi. And what are we gonna do here? Well, we're gonna design and build our own LED flashlight. LED flashlight? I love flashlights. Cool. They allow you to see at night, right? Yeah. Cool. All right. Do you have one made? Yeah, this one's made already. Let me show you. I'm going to turn it on. Whoa. Cool. Can I check yeah, it out? Yeah, go for it. Whoa. Look. It's really small. And it doesn't really look like a normal flashlight, but I can definitely peek in the little cracks and crevices. <laughs> cool. Well, how do we make one of these? Well, first, let's take a piece of wood. Oh, okay. down here. All right. And you got a piece of wood right there. Okay. Yeah. And we're going <laughs> to take some of this conductive tape. Oh, okay. It's shiny. Yeah. And we're going to put a piece of it on each side of the wood. Okay. So this tape is metal? It's got conductive material in it, like metal. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. And so you got one side done. Yep. Wow. And now then let's do the other side too. Okay. Put one on the other side. Just like the first side. There we go. Yeah, one on that side. One on that side. <laughs> Great. Yours looks just like mine. Now let's yeah. take a battery. Okay. Here's one right here, a battery. A little battery, and we're gonna clip it to one side of our flashlight. Okay. All right. Here's a clip. A little clip. Okay, now it's the fun part. We gotta pick an LED, a little light bulb. Oh, yeah! And we've yeah. got all these colors. Whoa, cool! They're really small. Looks like they have red. Ooh, I could pick from a yellow one. Oh, a blue one. Whoa! A white one or a green one. Hmm, maybe I'll do the green today. <laughs> I think I'm gonna do red. All right. Cool. So now we're going to take these little wires coming out of the light bulb uh -huh. and stick it over the tape. Okay. Oh, so it has to touch the conductive tape. Exactly. All so right. Mine's not turning on yet, though. Is yours turning on? No, it's not. It's not working. So here's the last step. We've got to flip these clips down. Oh, that makes sense to complete the circuit. To complete the circuit, right. Check oh, it out, you got Kevin. it. <laughs> yeah. Wow. That was awesome. Thank you so much for teaching us how to make an LED flashlight. Well, thanks for <laughs> building with me. All right. Well, I should keep exploring. Cool. Have fun out there. See ya. <laughs> See ya. Whoa. What is this? Whoa. It looks like a white cube stacked on top of other white cubes. Whoa. And look at this. Looks like someone was here before me. Oh, I have an idea. Why don't I try and make them connect? 
All right, how about like this? Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. All right, there we go. Now maybe I can put another cube. Yeah, a cube is just a bunch of squares. You see? Yeah. See a square and 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 a square, and, a square and, you and you put a bunch of squares together and it makes a cube. Six sides to a cube. All right, there we go. Whoa! We did it! Whoa! Whoa! Looks like someone made a really cool tower. Oh no! Well, it was really cool. Well, how about we rebuild it and make a new tower? All right, let's start with some squares, like this blue square and this red square and this green square. I don't see another big one, but if you connect them, Look at that! Yeah! Now it's a triangle! Whoa! <laughs> wow! Square! Triangle! Whoa, pretty cool! All right, let's flip it up. All right, now maybe we can put some things on the top, some triangles. Whoa! And then if they were really big, you could put them all together and then it would have a roof. <laughs> all right, what colors do we have? Orange, ooh, we have green, we have red, oh, ooh, we have purple, wow, so colorful, ooh, look at this one, yeah, the color yellow, whoa, <laughs> hello, <laughs> whoa, all right, I'll lay these flat, <laughs> now someone else can build their own colorful fort. <laughs> Whoa, so pretty and colorful. Whoa, oh, what does this one look like? Whoa, this one is also very colorful. How many colors do you see in there? I don't know, but there's a lot. <laughs> All right, whoa, let's see. Looks like another one. Whoa, there's even circles in there. Do you see all those little teeny circles? Wow, circles are so cute and small and colorful in there. Oh, here's one more. Whoa, look at that. Whoa, cool, that's awesome. <laughs> 996, 997, 998, 999. <laughs> Whoa, cool, this place is awesome. Whoa, look at this. Whoa, it looks like a steering wheel. <laughs> Whoa, like a steering wheel on a vessel, like we're sailing in the ocean. <laughs> Whoa, do you see that? Yeah, when you spin this, that spins. But when you stop it, that stops. All right, let's spin it to the right. Whoa, now that's spinning to the right. Let's spin it to the left. Whoa, now that's spinning to the left. Wow, and did you notice how colorful that is? Yeah, and sometimes when you mix colors, depending on the color, it makes a new color. Like say, if you mix blue and yellow, yeah, when you mix them, it makes green. Whoa, woohoo, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's keep exploring. Whoa, whoa, speaking of colors, this wall is so colorful. Whoa. Looks like we have some green lights, some red, some pink, ooh, and some orange. What does it say? I heart Moxie, Museum of Exploration and Innovation. That's where we're at, woohoo! All right, do you see when I pull this out? Yeah, it doesn't light up, but when you put it in, it does light up. It's because there's some light behind here and then the light bounces off the edges and the sides and then it comes out the end. Whoa, there you go. <laughs> Yahoo! <laughs> Whoa, look, <laughs> it looks like me. Wow, see my orange glasses? Ooh, and my bow tie? Oh, hello, Blippi. <laughs> All right, let's use a paintbrush, really big. Well, let's use some green. Ooh, look at this. Whee! 
<laughs> yeah, I can draw with my finger. Whoa, wow, so great. Ooh, what about a spray can? Let's do red. There we go, whoa, <laughs> yeah, wee, <laughs> this is looking really good. Oh, wait a second, why don't we make me a body? All right, there we go, all right. And then an arm, another arm, a leg, and a leg. There we go, there's a hand, there's another hand, there's my foot, there's my other foot. Whoa, oh, and my hat, wee. <laughs> All right, last but not least, the orange on my hat. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> there we go. Ha, how does that look? Really good, <laughs> all right. <laughs> wow, yeah, this, you can actually draw on it. Yeah, let's see, let's test it out. Here we go, okay, yeah, some spray paint. Okay, let's actually uh, make a red background. Actually, you know what? Let's erase that. Whoa, do you see it up there? Whoa, this is so cool. All right, how about let's spell Blippi. Yeah, you know how to spell Blippi, right? All right, let's get a blue and whoop. Here we go, ready? And watch up there at the same time. Here we go. B, L, I, <laughs> P, P, I. Flippy! Whoa! Good job! All right, this is so much fun. Are you having fun? I am too! Whoa! Cool! Wow, what a cool globe! Yeah! A globe or a sphere is a circle, but three dimensional. Yeah! And it says my name. Wow! Wasn't this so much fun today learning about science? Yeah! We learned about some colors and yeah, light, things that we can see with our eyes. Whoa! <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? Hold on. B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Blippi. Good job. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. <laughs> Make learning fun Blippi, Blippi So much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi! <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. Hi, I'm Nika. And today we are at Rockwood Music Hall. Yeah, in New York City, New York. I'm so excited to be in a space where musicians and singers get to share their music. Yeah, musicians and singers, they're so cool. And they play instruments. Ooh. Maybe we'll see some of those. <laughs> yeah, hey, let's go explore. Okay, come on. <laughs> oh, Blippi, look. Oh, check this place out. <laughs> yeah, there's wow. instruments everywhere. And look, a drum Whoa. kit. <laughs> Mika, that is a cool drum kit. Oh. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah. Oh. oh, and do you know what these are for? Hmm, are those drumsticks? You know it. Yeah! Oh, thanks, Mika. You're welcome. Okay. Ooh. Okay. All right, <laughs> Are we you can ready both play. For a drum off. Wait. One, two, one, two, three, four. Oh! <laughs> yeah! Yeah, drums are really cool. They keep the beat. You have yeah. to have really good rhythm to be a drum player. Mm-hmm, yeah. Do you know, when you dance, you need rhythm, but if you want to play the drums, you also need rhythm. Yep. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, let's see, what else is in here? It's on this table. Oh, look. A little tambourine. <laughs> and a big tambourine. Hello. <laughs> yeah, these are percussion instruments. Yeah. <laughs> you also need rhythm for these. That's right. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. What's that? This is a maraca. Whoa. Never seen one of these before? Ooh. Yeah, it sounds like there's something inside. Yeah, what Whoa. do you think it is? Mm, maybe. Macaroni? Ooh, or beans? Beans! <laughs> or maybe rice? Yeah! I don't 
Oh. Ooh. <laughs> I like how that sounds. Whoa, look at this. Oh, it looks Whoa. like a fish. <laughs> yeah, looks like a fish swimming in the sea. Mm -hmm, but <laughs> see know. all these lines in it? Oh, yeah, I do see those, Mika. If you take a Whoa. stick and run it over this area, it's going to make a cool sound. Try it out, Blippi. Okay, yeah. here we go. <laughs> Nice. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and it has holes, yeah. So the sound can make a lot of sounds that reverberate and it gets really loud. Ooh. Yeah. Whoa, <laughs> that's cool. Oh, what's here? Whoa. Have you ever oh. seen one of these before? <laughs> hmm. It's a cowbell. Moo. <laughs> Moo. Here, try hitting it. Okay. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Let's hit the cowbell. Whoa. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Should I hit it again? Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. Flip it. You got the beat. Oh. <laughs> wow, that was fun. Very nice. Ooh. And Mika, what about this? Here, you can hold the drumstick. Oh, do you know what shape this is? Hmm. Yeah, it's a triangle. Yep. Oh, look. It has three sides. One, two, Three! <laughs> yeah! Oh, Mika, you wanna try to hit it and see if it makes a sound? Yeah, usually you would use like a little metal stick or something to hit a triangle, but I'm gonna try the drumstick. Let's see what it does. <laughs> okay. Oh, whoa. It's a very calming sound. Yeah, you hit it like a cowbell, but <laughs> sounds like that. Beautiful. Oh, a recorder. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know those. Oh, I think. You put your fingers over the holes here, mm -hmm. yeah, and then you blow into it. <laughs> Whoa! Good job, Blippi! Oh, hey, I know another instrument that you blow into kind of like a recorder. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> hey, look, this one here! A flute! This Whoa. is a flute. It's a woodwind <laughs> instrument. Look at Whoa. all of these buttons. Wow, there's a lot. A lot of keys. <laughs> so many. <laughs> yeah, and then see this part, the mouthpiece? Yeah. That's where you blow air into the instrument. Let's see if I can make a sound. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, that was so beautiful, Whoa. Mika. <laughs> Whoa, Whoa. <laughs> you're pretty good at the flute. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I think I need a little more practice with the recorder. Here, let's try it at the same time, ready? Okay, here we go. in this. Hmm. Ah. It's a case of some kind. Yeah. Instruments sometimes can be really delicate. Yeah. Hmm, that means uh, something that could break. Yeah, easily. <laughs> yeah, so hmm, let's open it up. <laughs> oh, what's inside? Oh, it looks like a tiny oh. keyboard. Check it out, yeah. It's so small. Mm -hmm. hmm. Ooh. Can I give you that case, Mika? Yeah. Whoa. Huh. And it comes with this tube. <laughs> it's so Whoa. funny looking. Hey, look at this. Bet if we put that there, oh, maybe I should blow into the tube and see if it makes a sound. <laughs> okay, hey, I bet we can play this with teamwork. Oh, awesome. <laughs> okay, so you hit the keys okay. and I'll blow into it. Okay, ready? <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> Whoa. Let's do it again, ready? Okay, here we go. Okay. Oh, it's so loud! It's so loud! <laughs> yeah! Wow! This is called a melodica. Melodica! <laughs> melodica! <laughs> oh, that's a fun instrument. <laughs> oh, and Mika, what's that? Oh, this is an acoustic guitar. Oh, check it out! Yeah! It has strings on it. <laughs> yeah, how many strings are on this guitar? Ooh, will you count them with us? Okay. okay. One, two, three, Four, five, six. <laughs> Ooh, that sounds really pretty. Oh, yeah, a guitar has strings, and each string is a different note. That's right. <laughs> but Mika, what's it called when you play all the notes together? A chord. Ooh, so beautiful. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that was a pretty chord. Yeah, I love stringed instruments. Me They're too. They're really, really cool. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, this is a pretty cool guitar. Yeah. Ooh, what other <gasps> instruments have strings? 
strings. Uh, come right over here and look. Huh? Oh, a Whoa. piano. Yeah, check it out, it's a piano. Yeah, here, come closer. <laughs> oh, do you see inside? Oh, what do we see? There's Ooh. so many strings in there. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a lot more than six. <laughs> yeah, a lot. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think there's about 230 strings in a piano. 230 strings? Oh, <laughs> well, that's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot. And if you come over here, you'll oh. see the other end well, where all here. of the keys of the piano are. Oh, yeah. <laughs> a guitar, you strum. Mm -hmm. But a piano, even though there are strings, you get the keys. Ooh. That's right. Oh, here, <laughs> have the seat. Ooh, thank you. Ooh. <laughs> oh, have the seat. Thank you so much. <laughs> hey, because we both like to play the piano, should we play a duet? Yeah. A duet <laughs> is when two people perform the same piece together. Okay. Okay, I'll play the low part, and you can play the high part. Okay. <gasps> <sighs> okay, here we go. Ready. <laughs> slower than you. That's right, we want to play in the same, same time. time. Exactly, yeah. so first things first, you need to pick out an instrument. Okay, um, hmm. Ooh, I think I'll take this fish Ooh. and a drumstick. Ooh. Good choice. <laughs> I think I will also use a drumstick and I'm gonna play the cowbell. Ooh. <laughs> that's fun. Okay, so we're gonna take turns making up a song. Yeah, that sounds like a lot of fun. Yeah. But um, what should we sing about? We should sing about... <gasps> I'm feeling a little hungry. Mm, me Maybe too. we should sing about food. Oh, food. I love food. <laughs> me too. Mm. Um, hmm. Who goes first? So I can go first so I okay. can show you how to play. And okay. it's two lines and the second line has to rhyme. That's the Ooh. tricky part. Yeah. <laughs> well, that sounds like a lot of fun, but yeah. a little tricky need a rhyme. Exactly. Mm. So I'll say two lines and then you say two lines. And if we both rhyme, we win the round. <laughs> yeah, okay. Let's try it. Okay, ready? Let's keep a steady beat. Okay, a song about food. I like vegetables and I like fruit, but I hope I don't spill food on my suit. I really like to eat ice cream. I think Mika and me make a nice team. <laughs> that was so good. Yeah. Nice. Wow, that was awesome. Woo. It's hard, right? Yeah, really hard. You have to think so much. Yeah, you really <laughs> have to focus to keep the beat and try to rhyme. Well, it's kind of like patting your head and rubbing your tummy. <laughs> Basically. Mm. Okay, you choose the next subject. Hmm, okay. Uh, this time, let's do... Woo, colors! Oh yeah, that's a good one! <laughs> hmm. Uh, and this time, I'll go first. Yes! Okay, let's go! <laughs> my favorite colors are orange and blue. I know how to tie my shoe. Purple and yellow, that's my thing. I like to dance and I like to sing. Whoa, <laughs> that was a good rhyme. We did it again, yeah. round two. Yeah. <laughs> that was tricky. Yeah, thanks <laughs> but we for got you it. playing that game with me, Flippy. Oh, <laughs> well, yeah, I had a lot of fun playing with you, Mika. And thank you for playing along with us. Well, that's the end of this video. I hope you like the Blippi Mika show. Can you spell my name with me? Everybody spell it. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Will you spell my name with us? Okay, here we go. 
B L I P P I. Filippi. Good job. <laughs> hey, will you spell my name with us? Cool. M E E K A H. Mika. <laughs> yeah. Well, see you soon. Yep, we'll see you next time. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Flippy. <laughs> hey, it's me, Flippy. And today, we're here at Up Flying Yoga in Los Angeles, California. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. We're so high up in the sky. <laughs> Look, you can see the mountains and trees, even buildings. <laughs> well, I am so excited because you and I get to have fun doing aerial arts. <laughs> yeah, aerial means up in the air. <laughs> and we're gonna have lots of fun up in the air together. Come on. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. <laughs> I'm swinging in this hammock. <laughs> Normally, you might want to take a nap in a hammock, but this one is great for swinging in, climbing on, and spinning. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah, that's because this is an aerial hammock. Yeah, <laughs> you can do all kinds of things on it. Whoa, <laughs> it sure is fun. <laughs> oh, but if you're doing anything with aerial silks or aerial hammocks, you want to make sure there's a grown up nearby so you stay nice and safe. <laughs> okay, let's swing! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Look at me go! <laughs> Whoa! Hello! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah, you can swing sitting down or you can swing standing up. Woo! <laughs> Here we go! Whoa! <laughs> Look at me go! <laughs> Whoa! I'm up so high! Hello! <laughs> Woo! I'm a bird! Hello! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> well, that's pretty silly. <laughs> but I think I want to spin some more. Here we go! Whoa! Check it out! It's an aerial cube! <laughs> Woo! I bet we can climb up in this. Here we go! Whoa, look, <laughs> oh, so relaxing in the cube. <laughs> yeah, hey, do you know what a cube is? A cube is kind of like a square. Yeah, kind of like a square, but it's 3D. Whoa, and every side is the same size. Yeah, all six sides. Whoa, are the same. <laughs> Check it out. Whoa. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> this is kind of tricky. Woo. Whoa. Yeah, look. If you see it from this angle, it looks like a diamond. But I bet. Now, it kind of looks like a square. Woo. Yeah, a square. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> Woo. okay, <laughs> I should probably get down from here. Okay, here we go. Woo, <laughs> well, that was pretty fun, but I think I need a teacher to help me out a little bit. <laughs> it would probably make it a lot more fun and I could probably do some cool new things. <laughs> hmm. Let's go find someone to give us some tips. It's an aerial instructor. <laughs> Whoa, she's really good at this. <laughs> oh, maybe she can teach us. <laughs> Let's go ask. <laughs> hi, I'm Blippi. What's your name? Whoa, hi, Blippi. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Kimberly. Oh, it's nice to meet you, nice Kimberly. Thank you. <laughs> Whoa, you're really good at aerials. Thank you. Whoa, Ooh. well, we were doing some climbing and some spinning <laughs> and some swinging, but do you think you could help us? Uh, can you dance? Oh, I love to dance. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I love to dance. Perfect. Let's do some aerial dance then. Aerial dance? Oh, you mean we can dance, but in the air? That's exactly it. <laughs> yeah, I would love to. All okay. right, grab for your hammock. Okay, here we go. Whoa, <laughs> look at this hammock. So big and purple. <laughs> it's like a sail. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Woo. 
Okay, I have the hammock. Grab for one edge, bring your thumbs inside. Okay. Fingers, all four of them on each hand. On the outside, slide your hands outside of your hips. Okay. Reach for six handfuls. One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect, bring those elbows in, shoulders in. Ooh, okay. Press your fingertips towards the ground. Jump up inside. Whoa, <laughs> check it out. Ooh, we made it in the hammock. Hands up high towards the sky, all the way around the outside of the back. Grab it like a rope on each side. You can walk your legs forward so you're sitting on the very edge of this little ledge. Ooh, nice. And then slide your hands down so you've got it on both sides, just like you'd wear a belt. Ooh, here we go. <laughs> Good job. Yeah. All right, we're gonna go upside down. Are you ready? We get to go upside down? <laughs> yeah, I'm ready. You're gonna take your legs wide, keep your hands still, and then bring your feet together all the way around the front. Okay, here we go. Upside down, blippy! Woohoo! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! And then take your right foot and your left foot all the way around the outside of the purple fabric Ooh. to the front. Okay. Good job. Whoa! You look good. Yeah. <laughs> thumbs up. Thumbs up. Wait, thumbs down. Who's <laughs> that, <So> silly? <laughs> okay. You want to go for a spin? Yeah. Let's do it. Time to spin. <laughs> Don't want to get too dizzy. <laughs> Oh, so what should we do next? You want to do a handstand? Yeah. All right. Your fingers come on the floor, directly under your shoulders. Tuck your chin to your chest. Look at those toes. Flex your feet. Straighten out your legs. Now straighten out your hands. Whoa. Feet towards the sky even more. Handstand. Yeah. Check it out. Whoa, that was fun. You want to do a no hand handstand? A no hand handstand? Sure. All right. Straighten out the legs. Straighten out the arms. Okay. Hands off. Whoa, check it out! No hands! How stretchy are you? Can you reach to your toes? Reach for those toes. Yeah. Bend your knees. Whew. And lift up. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, we're up so high! But I do have one question. Kimberly, how do we get down? Oh, well that's even more fun. You're gonna reach for both hands on one fabric. Okay. All right, keep that left knee bent. Reach the right toes towards the floor. Come forward. Yes. And slide those hands down. Bend your right knee, grab a hold of your right hand with the right foot. Ta-da! Ta-da! Pigeon drop. Whoa! This is awesome! <laughs> Whoa, check it out! Look at these! <laughs> Whoa! They kind of look like a hammock, but there's not a place to sit. What are these called? This is called an aerial silk. It's like a hammock upside down. Whoa, an upside down hammock? <laughs> That's fun. Well, how do we play with these? You want to try to climb it? Yeah, that would be great. Okay. You're going to grab a hold of it. Okay. Yep. <laughs> and I want you to kind of hug the fabric with your legs so your right leg comes up. Okay. Turn around, give it a giant hug and flex the foot. Okay. You're going to slide the fabric underneath the toes. Oh, okay. And then you're going to reach your other foot onto the fabric and kind of hook it like you're crisscrossing. Great, so I pull Crisscross on the fabric. Crisscross to the other, yep. Like that. Awesome. It gets easier if you use both hammocks, or uh, both silks. Do you wanna try it together? Yeah, okay. We'll try both silks, see if I can climb to the top. Okay. Okay. So. Bring them together, give it like a giant little bear hug, your uh, leg. <laughs> okay, now we take our leg around. That's right. Like this. Yep. Flex our foot. Bring it as high as you can. Even higher. Woo. Even higher. Woo. Good job. And then, up we go! <laughs> Woo! You can go higher. Okay. Whoa! Look how high I am! All the way to the top, Lippy, good job! Whoa! I made it to the top! Whoa, look at how high we are! Everything looks amazing from up here. Okay, I think it's time to come down. Nice and slowly, you're gonna squeeze your legs together and walk your hands down. Work with your legs, not with your hands. Whoa, here I go! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> we made it! Good job! Yeah. Nice landing. Whoa, that was amazing! Oh, you've taught us so many amazing dance moves and how to climb a silk. <laughs> Thank you so much for teaching us today, Kimberly. You're welcome. Uh, well, I'll see you soon, I think. I have all these tools. Now I can do my very own aerial blippy dance. Bye-bye. Bye. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> it's time for some blippy dancing. <laughs> yeah. Kimberly was so helpful and taught us all kinds of dance moves. And now we can take those dance moves and make blippy choreography. Oh, that's kind of a big word. Choreography. <laughs> 
Have you heard that word before? Well, it's just a big fancy word for lots of dance moves put together. <laughs> we can do that. Time to dance! a great day with you today, learning all about aerial arts. <laughs> and we even got to dance to our very own aerial blippy dance. Woohoo! <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? <laughs> great. OK, here we go. B-L-I. P-P-I, -I. Philippi, good job. <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi! Rah, 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 rah. Blippi, did you see what I was just doing? <laughs> I was acting like a dinosaur. <laughs> That's so silly. Yeah, and today we're at Santa Barbara Museum of Natural History in Santa Barbara, California. And I have a great idea. Why don't you and I go inside and see if we can find some dinosaurs? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Do 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 do! <laughs> wow, I'm having a lot of fun! Whoa! <gasps> Look at this! Prehistoric forest? Wow! Prehistoric? Yeah, that was a really long time ago. And actually, at a point of prehistoric times, there was dinosaurs! I love dinosaurs. Do you love dinosaurs? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Did you hear that? Yeah, that was a dinosaur roaring. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. What is this? Wow, looks like a really colorful book. I wonder what's inside. Whoa. <laughs> All right. <gasps> wow, there's a letter, a message. It says, find these five dinosaurs in the prehistoric forest. We're there right now. Whoa. Then choose your favorite dino and color it. Whoa, cool. All right, looks like we have to find these dinosaurs. Whoa, cool. There's three dinosaurs. Ooh, four and five. All right, let's find all five of these dinosaurs and then we'll color one. This is gonna be so much fun. Yeah. <laughs> This dinosaur just roared! So cool! Do you know what kind of dinosaur this is? Hmm, it does have plates on its back. Huh, I wonder if it's in this book. All right, is it this dinosaur? No, let's see. Oh, what about this one? Definitely not. Could be this one. Close, but that's not it. Huh, what about that one? No. <gasps> is it this one? Yeah! You can tell by all those plates. Oh, I know what kind of dinosaur this is. It's a stegosaurus. Yeah, I could tell because the plates on its back. Every stegosaurus have at least 17 plates. Yeah, or more. So cool. And they actually are herbivores. That means they eat plants. I like eating plants too. 
<laughs> yeah, like lettuce or like salad and spinach. Yum! So healthy. <laughs> okay, hey, we should probably check this box off so we can keep track of what dinosaurs we find. All right, made a little X right there. Wow, perfect. Whoa, cool. All right, let's keep exploring and see what other dinosaurs we can find. Yeah! <laughs> see ya! Please do not touch or feed the dinosaurs. <laughs> okay, I definitely won't touch or feed the dinosaurs. Whoa, check it out, another dinosaur. Whoa, do you know what kind of dinosaur this is? Well, it looks like it has some horns. Oh, there's a baby right there. Hello, hey. All right, let's see if we can find the dinosaur in the book. Is it this dinosaur? Oh, yeah! You're right, it is! All right, we need to mark it off right here. Yeah! Do you know what kind of dinosaur that is? Yeah, it's a Triceratops. Do you know how we know? Yeah, come here, I'll show you. Wow! All right, do you see the horns? Yeah, let's count them together. One, two, Three horns. Yeah, its name is Triceratops. Tri, T-R-I. Tri means three. Yeah, so this is a Triceratops. Wow, good job. <laughs> well, let's keep exploring and see what other kind of dinosaurs we can find. Yeah! Another dinosaur. Wow, this dinosaur looks so cool. Well, hey, let's see if this dinosaur is in our book. Whoa, hey, dinosaur. <laughs> All right, okay, well, it's not this one. Yeah, because this one's the Triceratops, remember? Yeah. All right, what about one of these two? Is it this one? Definitely not. What about this one? Oh, yeah, it does look like this one. Good job, we found another dinosaur. All right, let's check it off. Put a little X right there. Wow, awesome. <laughs> well, this dinosaur does look really cool, but I don't know the name of this dinosaur. Huh, I wonder what kind of dinosaur this is. Oh, hey, Hi. how are you? I'm Jenna, I'm the director of education. Wow, that's cool. So that means you know a lot about dinosaurs? I do know a lot about dinosaurs. Wow, well my friends and I were just trying to think of this dinosaur's name. Do you know its name? I do, this is an Eoplocephalus. Eoplocephalus, that's hard to say. Wow, do you know any cool facts about this dinosaur? I know a lot of cool facts about this dinosaur. Wow. It's covered in armor from its head all the way down to its tail. Wow. It's got spikes on its back, horns on its head, and even a club tail. Oh yeah, the club tail. Ooh, and the spikes and the horns. Wow, and the really thick armor skin. Why does this dinosaur have all of that? Yeah, this dinosaur has all of those features to protect it from predators. Whoa, that's really cool. Well, thank you so much for teaching us the name of this dinosaur and some fun facts. Is there any other dinosaurs that you could show us? Oh, absolutely. All right, let's go. <laughs> Another dinosaur, yeah! Whoa, this is a really cool looking dinosaur. Wow, should we check to see if it's in the book? Let's check. All right, <laughs> all right, let's see. Oh, well, it's not this dinosaur. We already found that dinosaur. Ooh, is it this dinosaur? No, okay, we found that one. Let's see, what about this dinosaur? Oh yeah! It is! Wow, good job! Thanks so much for helping us find this dinosaur. All right, let's check it off. There we go. Wow, that's awesome. Well, what kind of dinosaur is this? 
This is a parasaurolophus. Parasaurolophus. Wow, that's a hard name to say. And what's that thing on its head? Is that a horn? It's actually not a horn. Oh. It's actually a sinus. A sinus? Like it connects to the nose? It connects to its nose. Wow, why do they have that? Well, they use it almost like a trombone. They suck in air and then they blow it out as a really loud, deep sound. Oh, I know what a trombone is. <laughs> cool. Whoa, and look at its mouth. It's really wide. Yeah, it's so it can hold hundreds of teeth. Oh, really? Like really strong, big, sharp, massive teeth? Well, actually more of a lot of little teeth. <laughs> oh, that's cool. What does it eat with its teeth? It eats lots and lots of plants, a lot of plants. Wow, really? And do they then grow in and then stay there forever? Well, no, they're constantly losing their teeth. Kind of like little kids do. And then new teeth grow in and they eat more plants. Wow, that is really cool. Thank you so much for teaching us about these two dinosaurs. <laughs> You're welcome, Blippi. I've got more dinosaur things to do today. All right, <laughs> see you later. Thank you so much. Wow, that was really nice of her. All right, so we found four dinosaurs, but we need to find five dinosaurs. So there must be one more dinosaur around here. <gasps> Another dinosaur. Wow, this dinosaur looks so big and furious. <laughs> All right, let's see if this dinosaur is in our book. All right, it's not that one. <laughs> okay, is it this one? Yeah, it's our last dinosaur. Good job. All right, let's check it off. There we go. Whoa. All right. Hey, do you know what kind of dinosaur this is? Yeah, it's a T-Rex, Tyrannosaurus Rex. So big and fierce, but cute teeny little arms, whoa. <laughs> and do you see its teeth? Yeah, they are very big and very sharp. Yeah, and they're actually shaped like a banana. Whoa. Wow, T-Rexes are so cool because their jaws are so strong. They're actually the most strongest jawed dinosaur that we know of. Wow, and actually what we think now, the juveniles, the teenagers of T-Rexes actually might've had some feathers. Wow, T-Rexes are so cool. <laughs> All right, now let's go pick a dinosaur and color it in. This is gonna be fun. Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Wow, wasn't that so much fun learning about those five dinosaurs? Wow, and they were all so big, and it was cool to learn about what they eat. Whoa, and their teeth. <laughs> all right, let's uh, decide which dinosaur we should color. <laughs> all right. Let's see, the Triceratops, or one of these two. Huh, let's see. How about, I was supposed to pick my favorite dinosaur out of these five. The T-Rex is pretty cool, but I don't know if I can pick my favorite because they're all so cool. Well, hey, why don't we color the Stegosaurus? So then we can color the plates all different colors. Wow. All right, first let's take the green one. Ooh, here you go, Stegosaurus. Ooh, nice green plate. Ooh, how about red? Whoa, there you go. Whoa, this is gonna be a very colorful Stegosaurus. Yeah, I used orange, one of my two favorite colors. <laughs> Ooh, we'll use my second other favorite color. Yeah, blue. There we go. Whoa, so colorful. Yeah, do you remember what stegosauruses eat? Yeah, plants, because they're herbivores. Ooh, how about pink? Mm. <laughs> there you go, yeah, pink. Ooh, and let's do the last plate as purple. Whoa, look at that. Now that is a colorful stegosaurus. All right, last but not least, a green scribble. Whee! <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Oh, hey, I have an idea. Why don't we take green and draw a plant right here? Yeah, like it's eating. 
Ooh, there you go. Kind of hard to see. <laughs> wow. What a great stegosaurus. Very colorful. They didn't look like this back then, but it still looks really cool. Whoa. That was so much fun learning about dinosaurs with you. I sure do love dinosaurs. What magnificent creatures they were. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah. B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. Good job. All right, well, I'm going to keep this book right here. So then the next person that comes here, they can color one of their favorite dinosaurs. Yeah. All right, see you later. Bye-bye. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout.